Hey everybody, Raven out here in the great frozen tundra of Washington. Hey, today we're going to be talking about uh, about the uh, uh, Wit manufacturing brake. We bought this to put on my Odd 6 to see if we can't keep that thing from kicking like a mule. Now today we're going to be using the Hornaday. These are the 150 SSTs. Very nice ammunition, by the way. Uh, we're going to see what this does as far as uh, as far as that kick that I'm trying to prevent. Now, uh, this is a slip-on, and it's a bolt down. It's basically, what you do is uh, you take and you measure the tip of your barrel, and down an inch and a half, you send in those two dimensions to Wit Manufacturing. They will take and manufacture you a brake that's specifically for your rifle. Now, once you get this thing, you're going to take it and you look at it. it's nice. This is the unfinished model. They also have, uh, uh, you can get Cerakote on those, uh, you can have different colors, it's a nice little product. Now what we're going to do is we're going to test this through the chronographer to see if uh, if it reduces the, the foot per second. And then also my shoulder is going to tell us what kind of recoil we actually have at the end of the day. Now when you install these, you take, um, you take your blue Loctite, spin it around the barrel so you've got a little bit of a lubricant to slide this thing down tap it with a rubber maul, get it set into place, and then you turn around and make sure you got the level on here, you get it cranked on, zip it down, and let it dry. From there you're good to go. So now what we're going to do is we're going to give you some uh, some base shots off the odd six with the uh, chronographer, and then we're going to slip this on and give a couple more shots and see what it does. And as always, eyes and ears. That one's 3,013 feet. That one there was a little close to the sides. Uh, we'll go with that 3,100 feet, nice little average there. Now we're going to slip on the brake and see what it does. As you can see, the wit brake has been installed. Uh, it doesn't look too bad on the barrel. You know, it's been clamped down with those three bolts there. Let's give her a run and we'll see what she does. Okay, yeah. well, we hit 29.43 with both rounds. Recoil, substantially less. I can shoot this thing all day now. Uh, is it worth the, uh, well, 29.43 to 3,100? You know, is it worth that 100 foot, 50 foot a second? Absolutely. I'd do this all day long. Uh, for those of us that like to go out and shoot consistently, lots of rounds, now I can shoot this thing for a considerable amount of time. This makes my, my old favorite rifle one of my new favorite rifles again. Wit Manufacturing, thanks out there guys, you did a good job. This is a heck of a deal. I recommend anybody out there that's into shooting these high caliber rifles, put one of these on your rifle. Doesn't look bad, it looks decent. Uh, doesn't take away from the rifle, like I said, other than that, uh, about 150 foot a second. Running those Hornady 150 grain bullets, they are uh, pretty consistent with their with their match. And, uh, you know, 2943 off 30, well, just shy of 3100. Can't complain. All right, Raven out. Peace.